90% of the Earth's population are sea monsters. Thanks to the Sea Monster Serum. <laughs> you remember your ex-wife, Landy? Well, she's with me now. I hate sea monsters, and everyone in the world right now is becoming a sea monster. So I figure the only way to stop this is to blow up the world. Grandpa, I want no part of that. It's, we're just, uh, we're playing a game. It's for a game. We caught you in the middle of your plan again. We're gonna stop you. We already buried the bomb. And Mulligan's tied up on the other side. And I'm gonna blow it up right now. What, if this is a toy, then where's the real detonator? Buttons. Well, I do like pressing buttons. Larry! I think I left the detonator in the cake. You gotta give it to me. Was it a little black rectangle with two buttons on it? Yeah, that's it. You've seen it? Oh, I saw it. I couldn't decide whether to press the button or not. So I ate it. You ate it? Was that bad? Yes, that's bad. I need that detonator. <sighs> Come with me before Anthony and Ryan find you. And that's the other hole I dug. That's a great hole, but- Don't flatter him. It's really not. Hey, this took me nine hours. Okay, listen, there's more important things than your hole. Yeah, Grandpa's going after the detonator and we need to stop him before he blows up the world. It's not a real bomb, it's just role play. How many times do I have to explain this? Okay, sure, it's a role play. And if you want to win the game, you have to get that bomb. Don't worry. I already buried the bomb. No, we don't need you to bury the bomb. We need you to unbury the bomb. So take that shovel and get to work. Oh, this? This here is a harpoon. <sighs> okay, so take that harpoon and dig up the bomb and get it as far away from Earth as possible. Right, on it. What are you guys gonna do? We're gonna get that detonator before Grandpa does. You guys probably should have done that a while ago. He's got a point. having a tickle fight. No, I'm trying to detonate the bomb from inside your stomach. Oh. Yeah, well, get off, stand still. <sighs> I don't think it's working. Oh, thanks, Captain Obvious. What made you figure that one out? Come on, let's go. Where are we going? The toilet, you're gonna poop it out. <sighs> Great, we're too late. Andrew was actually right for once. No, 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 no. You see that? We're not late. The cake we made earlier? Exactly. Judging by that cake, I can tell that the detonator is in my dad's stomach, and Grandpa's trying to get him to poop it out as we speak. You got all that from a piece of cake. Yeah, every time my dad eats cake, other things tend to get mixed in there. Okay, so now we have to find him and Grandpa. I have a better idea. Grandpa's hatred for sea monsters stems from his ex-wife. If we can find her, bring her here, and have them make up, he won't have a reason to blow up the world anymore. <sighs> Wouldn't it just be easier to get Larry to poop out the detonator? <laughs> okay, you'd think, but that's not an easy task. My dad hasn't pooped in months. Come on, push! Push! Harder! The fate of the world lies in the hands of your large intestine! <sighs> Grandpa, this is useless. I can't go! Sure you can! No, I can't and definitely not with you staring at me like that. Huh? Oh, sorry. Uh, what if I take a step back? That won't help. Things that go in my body never come out. You're telling me you never poop? I haven't been able to go in months. How is that possible? I don't know. I think I have a car parked in my butt. Yeah, I can guarantee that is not the case. Come on, we're gonna go to the doctor so they can fix you. <laughs> nice, you're brilliant. This is not gonna take it away from Earth. It's just gonna bring it somewhere else. How do I get this to outer space? I got it. I don't know about this. Trust me, Grandpa's always told me that all the things he'll never tell me are in this case. Hey, what are you guys doing here? This is my room now. <laughs> well, now you know how it feels to always have people walking in and out of your room uninvited. Oh, I don't mind when other people do it, but just you specifically. So let's just say that all the answers we're looking for are inside of this case. How do we get it open? Well, you see? There's a little keypad right here. We just gotta put in the password, and boom, secrets. And do you know what the password is? N no. 
Uh, but, but, I bet he does. Why would I know the password? Because you're his favorite grandson. Okay, so why don't you just try putting in Toph? Huh, yeah, I, I guess that was kind of obvious. Uh, okay, um. Toph is the key to life. Ah! Ah! God! Yeah, great plan, Anthony. Did you find what you were looking for? Okay, listen, I, I understand that what we just saw is disturbing and we'll never be able to unsee it, but did you not see that spare mustache in there? I swear, I knew that thing came off. Yeah, you know what? That's the last time we're ever going with one of your plans. It's my turn now. Let's go. Uh, hey, Christopher, you know the, the world is ending, right? You wanna, you know, maybe come help us? Eh, Grandpa's gonna lose anyway. And I have so much sleep to catch up on. You know how many videos it's been since I've slept? Good point. Brian? Hey! Wait up! It is official. He has car parked in butt, stopping poop from exiting. I knew it! You've gotta be kidding. Parallel park. And not to mention, my pants are still too big. Ugh, this is bad. No, it is actually pretty good car, Nissan Ultima. So that is where my old car went. Oh, yep. So what are we supposed to do about this? Well, I can use Shrink Ray on you. That way you can go inside and drive the car out. I am not going inside of Larry's butt. Oh, that is very okay. I can do it. Come on, Larry. We're out of here. No, do not go anywhere. I get shrink ray and bigger pair of pants. We can't leave now. I want to see these bigger pair of pants. Why are we here? Because your plan failed, so now we're going with mine. Okay, wait, no, hold on. My plan didn't fail, okay? We got the safe open. We just didn't like what we found. Okay, true. But regardless, the person who would know more about Grandpa than any of us is his arch nemesis. Ah, good idea. So who are you gonna get? You! Why else would we be here? Oh, I thought you were here to untie me. Okay, we'll untie you if you tell us everything we need to know about Grandpa's ex-wife and where we can find her. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Untie him? <laughs> no, 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 no. This is my plan, and that is not part of the plan. Okay, it's the least that we can do if he's gonna help us save the world. Oh, so you wanna know about Landy, huh? Landy? Well, I mean, if you were a sea monster trying to blend in on land, wouldn't you call yourself Landy too? Yeah, if I was an idiot, that only makes it more suspicious. Good point. Anyway, she lives with me. I stole his ex-wife. <laughs> okay, okay, what? When did that happen? Two videos ago. Luca too. I know I wasn't in that one, but it happened off camera. Okay, well, we got everything we need to know. Her name is Landy, and she's living at Mulligan's house. Let's go. Aren't you gonna untie me? No, you're a villain. But we had a deal! Ha, so what? If it was the other way around, you wouldn't untie us either. True. Come on, Anthony, let's go. Wait, it was a part of the deal. Go on time. <sighs> Gross, no, why do I have to do it? Because I can't, that would be impossible. <sighs> You're right. Listen, you gotta poo. I'll try my best. Here, take this for motivation. Thanks. If anything's gonna make me poo, it's Ryan Feeney. All right, get to work. I'll be right up here. Hey, how you doing in there? Larry? Larry? <gasps> he ran off! What? What is that? So are you excited? Why would I be excited? Well, because. Isn't this the first time you're meeting your grandma? Yeah, you're right. Grandma! That is not what I thought she was going to look like. Hey! Oh. Oh. Looking for something? <gasps> the detonator! How did you get that? I kidnapped Larry through the bathroom window, and then I squeezed it out of him! That's disgusting. Now give it to me! No way! I don't want the world to end. I've got so much life left to live. I want to be an actor, travel the world, and finally learn how to ride a bicycle! Uh, yeah, that's great and all, but, uh, I'm gonna blow up the world now. What?! How did you get that?! I took it while you were daydreaming about your future. Now, if you'll excuse me... <laughs> we're both pretty bad at being villains, huh? Where did it go?! I have it, and I finally decided I'm gonna press it. <gasps> ah! Huh? I didn't know the end of the world was gonna sound like a cell phone. Oh wait, actually, uh, I don't think the button worked. That's just my actual cell phone. 
up. Hello? Hey, Grandpa. <laughs> Not to brag, but I won the game. Andrew, what's that weird number you're calling me from? I'm in jail. You're in jail? I figured the best way to get rid of a bomb was to throw it into space. So I took it to the airport to get on a plane and just launch it out there. You did what? Well, I tried. Security stopped me long before I got on the plane, and they disarmed it. Ugh! Andrew, you ruined my plan! Yeah, that's why you lose the game, and I win! You want a rematch? It's not a role play, you dumb dumb! Wait. Do you mean to tell me I'm really in jail? Yes! Oh. Well, can you come bail me out? <sighs> hey, thanks for getting that car out of my butt. Oh, anytime. It was my pleasure. Grandpa, wait! Before you blow up the world, just hear us out. Oh, actually, I, uh... uh... Let me finish. We spent all day getting something for you that we think is gonna change everything. Oh, did you buy yourself a one-way ticket to Alaska? No. Did you pay a magician to make yourself disappear? Forever? No! Okay, then, uh, hold on, let me guess. Did you, uh... None of this has anything to do with me disappearing. Well, then it ain't gonna make anything better. Grandpa, just trust us. You're gonna feel so much better. Aren't you gonna answer that? No. It's for you. Landy? Boys, I've been dreaming of this day all my life. This is the nicest thing that anyone's ever done for me. Thank you. You slammed the door in her face. Yeah. And it felt great. What? Well, you brought her here so I can kill her, right? No! We brought her here so you guys could make up and you wouldn't want to blow up the world anymore. Oh, yeah, you see? That's never gonna happen. I closed the door so she wouldn't see me grab my harpoon! Grandpa, Grandpa, wait, wait. Let's just think about this for a moment. Oh, I thought about this for a long time. <laughs> 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 Hey guys, if you didn't know, we have brand new Culture 35 Luca Sea Monster merch. It looks like this. Make sure you go get your own at culture35.com or at the link in the description down below. Also, I just want to take a second to say thank you guys so much for getting us to 700,000 subscribers. Seriously, when I started, I never imagined myself having this many subscribers. I thought that maybe someday I'll break 100,000 and it'll probably level off at there and then I'll fade away. But somehow it's kept growing and all of a sudden the dream of reaching a million subscribers doesn't seem out of the realm of possibility anymore and that's absolutely insane. Seriously, thank you. If you wanna see some bloopers and behind the scenes for this video, you can at the link down below or the link at the top box on screen at the end of the video. If you enjoyed, make sure to give this video a like, leave a comment letting us know what you thought and subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss when we post new videos. Follow us on Instagram at Call 235 and on TikTok at realcall 235 for some extra bonus content. And that is about it. Thank you guys again so much for watching. We'll see you again next week with a brand new video. Bye guys.